DIF, we're gonna short this right here at the ask if we can get hit. All right, we're in. We're in at 81.61 and it's already eating us up here. Went in way too early on this trade, but we think it drops and it drops pretty dramatic. Uh, stop loss will be over the highs here and target will be uh, like 80.50 area. That's why you don't go in the first candle because of that you never know. But it had moved so much already I didn't want to miss a chance and might have to come out sooner. All right, here it comes. Market is dropping. We got tailwind. There we go. I'd like to see it below eight. All right. TIF. It's like big battle here at 81.50. TIF. All right. It's coming back down. All right. We're going to try to take this here just in case. All right. We took about, what is that? 70 cents. It's just taking too long to drop. But that's good. We'll take that. Let's take a look at ADSK. This thing looks about ready to drop here. We're going to take this for a short here at the ask. If we can get in, it's not going to hit us. I'm going to give it a couple more seconds if it don't hit. All right. It's just going to drop right here. That stinks. That would have been a nice trade. Cancel that. NVDA. We're going to take this for a short right here at the ask. If we can get hit. All right. We got a hundred. So if we can get full in here. All right, we're full in at 159.63. Data looks okay for short. It's been down trending past few sessions. And uh, intraday gaps down, flushes. It's getting bought up a little bit here, but market looks weak. So we think this thing is going to drop below the lows. So target's going to be uh, probably around one, uh, 158.75 area. And stop loss will be... Uh, around 160.50 about a point each way let's take a look at this thing up close stock and move you gotta be careful with this one nvda all right we're gonna probably come out of this if this doesn't uh drop soon yeah we're gonna come out of this right here i don't like the way it's acting all right we're out we're out with a 30 cent loser market's starting to wake up a little bit and uh I thought it was going to turn there and drop, and it didn't, so i better come out with a small loser. TIF, we're going to take this for a short right here. This thing is really extended. This thing's got a lot of baggage. So I think once it stops uh, dropping, right, we're in. We're in at 83.84, second trade on it. This thing's uh, extended this morning, and uh, I think once it's done, this initial... Uh, rally here from the lows i think it's going to drop it'll probably drop hard too because if you look at the daily here this daily is disastrous but stop loss will be uh over the highs and target i like point point each way all right here it comes i might scalp it depending on what the market does not sure yet all right we're going to take this right here all right we're out nice i'll just take that it is uptrending. We took about 60, a little over 60 cents, like 65 cents. NVDA, look at this. Good thing we got out of it. Still climbing. Roku, we're going to take this for a short right here at the ask. All right, we're in. It's a risky trade here because it's up so much. If we look at the daily here, this thing just looks nasty high, right? But because it's nasty high like that, they're going to take profits. They have to, you know? If they're smart, they'll take profits because eventually it will drop and it will drop hard. And, uh, you know, you don't want to be the last one there holding the bag, right? So we think it drops here. It's down for the day. Intraday, it opens and it flushes. Now it's getting bought up a little bit because the market's getting bought up. But we think it drops. Target on this will be, uh, I like 144 and stop loss will be, uh, stop loss will be around 145.50. Let's take a look at this thing up close. This thing can move though, so Roku. All right, it's coming down. See what we can do with this. We might scalp it. If it's got momentum, we'll leave it because the market's climbing here. So I might take it earlier. Roku. See it drop below 144.50. We got about 40 cents. Uh, you know what? Let's just take this just in case it doesn't drop. All right, we're out. We're off for about, oh, look at it. It's going to drop. It's going to drop. But anyways, we took uh, 40 cents, about 45 cents close to it. Take that. And it's probably going to drop. Oh, there it goes. I was just going to say it's probably going to drop below 144, and there it goes. 
Oh man, look at that. Another point. I missed it. Autodesk. Yeah, I've been looking at the stock since the open and uh, it just kept putting in green candles. As soon as I saw that red one, I'm like, ah, let's give it a shot. I think it might drop here. But the market's uh, helping it out. So, ADSK. All right, it's looking good. Let's take a look at this thing up close here. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can get it below 133, then maybe we'll take it. It's looking good. Let's see if it can crack. 133. Once it cracks, we'll probably take it. Doesn't want to crack. Come on, crack. Big fight here at 133. All right. Let's take this right here. All right, we're out. Nice. Nice. We took, uh, what did we take? 80 cents. Take that. Just in case. Just in case it, uh, it pops there because the market's still uptrending. But it looks like it's still dropping. But that's going to be it for us today. Don't really see anything else. Market's screaming higher, so it'll probably pull back soon. Has not put in a, a red candle since uh, the second candle here. If we look at the SPY here, look at that thing. Just green all the way. And, uh, you know, I don't really see anything else at the moment. So, so that's going to be it for us today. We're up uh, 328. Let's take a look at the trades. Five trades. Four winners and one loser. Our biggest winner on uh, ADSK and our loser on NVDA. Thanks for watching.